Oh, was he good. He danced behind her. The, the ladies danced gentle, you know, little movements, little hands moving here and there. And the men, the boys and men, because well, we saw this again later on, oh, they jump up and down and laughing and clapping and hollering and everything. Just the one kid. He was wonderful. He was, a, you could tell he was an outgoing kid. He's going to be an entrepreneur. He's going places. So then after that, we went and we went to, we tried to get into each classroom and, te and the la um, our lady, Janie, came down and she says, don't spend so much time in these first classrooms. Go in the back. These children won't see you. And everyone we went into, the teachers, so many men were teachers. One little young lady, she said she was training to be a teacher and she was taking over the class. And they were reading from uh, Bible things and they were doing math and they were uh, answering questions you know and and it was just great and then they then I I was taking pictures and I said I, I'm I'm the official photographer here I'm taking your picture and when I get home I'll send the picture back to you you know and, oh boy all the smiles come around you know and the teacher was all smiles one teacher he he wrote his name down for me and I said good I says um uh, I need the headmaster's uh, name and address. And he says, this will be fine. Uh, you send it to me, and I will bring it to him because we have no post office for the school here. And our elder hostel group brought them a great big box of books, and we also brought them a check. Every school we go to, we bring them a check, and it's well received. And I asked Lucy when we were in um, Fiji, I said, what do you think? Is it maybe a hundred? Or And she says, oh, more. So Elder Hostel contributes to the schools with uh, books and pencils and things like that and, and uh, with money. And, the, oh, gosh. Do you know, this was the very first time that they ever had visitors. It was just uh, not only from the United States, from any place. I mean, they had to go to the political department and asked for permission to go there and they loved it and the kids loved it and then I said this is the last picture I can take this will be the last one and I took the picture and then it goes and they're all looking 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 and I said it is rewinding all the way back the film goes all the way back and then I opened it up and I showed it to them oh boy ah <gasps> ah oh, there's a gas ah <gasps> and then I I said now I'm taking this back to the United States and then I will make the pictures and I will send you a picture of your the ones that I took in the class here well Papaloa says that they will love this. They will put those pictures on the wall for eternity. She says they have never had anything like that. So that'll be good. And Betty's going to send all of hers back. And I think other people are, after uh, Papaloa told uh, the crowd today that uh, I had the address and was going to send, and then the others said, well, can we send some of ours? You know, and they said yes. So then we went around to the crafts uh, and uh, shopping and looking. We were looking for Matt. We were looking for Matt, Ralph and I, for the new house there. And uh, we were looking for one like seven foot, straight across, a round one. Well, the biggest one they've got is five foot across. So we have to do some thinking about whether we want to do that or not. And when we were looking, there was a couple of Tongan ladies that come along. I didn't take a picture. I should have. Stood by Ralph. He looked like a peanut standing next to them. It was the funniest thing. I said, Ralph, I, I always thought you were a big man, but boy, next to those gals, wow. And some of the feet on these guys, oh, the guys in church, we saw them. They were in front of us, and they were like, the lecterns, and uh, it was always their time to get up and, and speak or sing or something, and they had the blue jackets on, and they had their lava lava skirts on their knees that set, and bare feet, everybody had bare feet, bare feet, 
huge feet, <laughs> size 14, 16, 18, as high as you can go. Oh, it's unbelievable. <laughs>